and we'll call this out from Hales. Thank you very much for joining us. Man of the match, good win. You've got your stop watch in hand there. What a good game all round. Yeah, uh, good to get back on winning tracks. Obviously enjoyed getting the start and my foot down, but getting three points today was all really the main aim. Um, against a tough opposition, but turning it around after a draw the other night, which we disappointed with, but back on winning tracks now. Two assists uh, as well today. Is that what you bring to the table? Defensive duties, but at the same time getting forward and creating chances? I like to think so, yeah. The um, game's about getting forward, obviously. A bit of pace, getting behind, whip balls in. Hopefully the big man get on the end of it like he did today. So I'm just doing my job for the team, really. Obviously, the, the club's going through a, a transition period. It's, it's growing in stature on, on every level. You've come in and you've been a part of that. Just tell us a little bit about your journey with Stockport County. Oh, so I came in, I think it was September time, um, seen the setup, seen, she spoke to the gaffer, spoke to the Simon, the chairman, everyone, um, told me about their ambitions and just wanted to jump straight on board, really. Um, obviously, then came in, the training facility is championship level, it's, it's ridiculous. When I, when I speak about it to other people, they're like, they're baffled as well. We can't really describe it until you're there. So, the club's going in the right direction, I've just got to put the points on the board, get, uh, get up there then. Christmas has, uh, has been a bit of a tricky period, shall we say, for County. Maybe not all results going the way we would have liked. Promotion, though, is obviously the main aim. What's the feeling like inside the camp there? I think we've seen them. We're, we're sitting in third of two or three games in hand on everyone, so we're in, a, we're in a great place. A couple of bad results recently, but it doesn't determine where we're in the league. We're there for a reason, so we're still pushing. A lot of games to play still, a lot of points to pick up. So hopefully we keep running, keep this run going and uh, pick some points up and push. Was it, was it more important today to get points against Wrexham because they're up there as well and they're going to be one of the teams competing come the end of the season? Yeah, there's two ends of the stick. Obviously, they're up there. Uh, they're competing on a good run as well. And, um, so, to stop our rot as well. We've had a couple of bad results recently. So, but a good result in many, many ways today. With games being postponed for COVID and then coming back and then more games being postponed because of COVID, just, just what's it been like as a player trying to get used to this bizarre season? It's always tough, especially when I stop and start. Um, lots of the games called off last year for weather, but then this year it's just been really non-stop. You don't know whether you're going to play or not. It's just you could get a text before the game saying that one of their lads tested positive or one of our lads might fall ill. So it's always it's always going to be up and down, really. But you've got, you've got to try and stay level-headed for Friday. Obviously, train when you can. Uh, pick the games up and pick the points up. But it's a positive mood. Big year, 2021 promotion. It's on the cars, isn't it? Yeah, it's there. It's on the cards, obviously, we're just taking each game as it comes. Um, pick, pick three points up, pick a point up if needed, but ultimately promotion is, is in our heads. And is it a big New Year celebration with the game being the next day, or is it a quiet one? Yeah, it's a quiet one. <laughs> Always quiet. <laughs> well, listen, thanks very much for joining us. I hope you have a, a very happy New Year, and Thank we'll you. see you New Year's Day. Thank you very much, Daniel.